Texas Lakes, no doubt about it, we love them. They are a part of what makes Texas, Texas. Hi there. If you're an avid outdoorsman like me, you probably love spending the day on the lake fishing or hunting. Texas lakes are full of fun. But if we're not careful, they could also become full of invasive species that can ruin the fun for all of us. I'm talking about the worst of the worst. Giant salvinia, zebra mussels, I get shivers just thinking about them. They're already in many Texas lakes, so we have to keep those villains from spreading to uninfested lakes. So you're thinking, what can I do to help? Well, let's roll up our sleeves and get to work. We can get Wally here to show us how. The first step, clean your boat. Invasive species are sneaky little invaders and they try to hitchhike a ride by grabbing onto your boat or trailer, even hiding in mud and other debris. So clean it and clean it good. Everything that's been in the water, even the anchor and the uh, anchor line. Oh, don't forget about man's best friend. It's important to check the motor and the prop. Uh, you missed a piece there, Wally. Uh, that's better. We all need to remember that even the tiniest plant piece can cause a new infestation at another lake. Step two, drain your boat. After you've cleaned your watercraft and before you leave the ramp area, you have to drain water from every space that can hold it. Those zebra mussels like to hide in water. They start out too small to see with the naked eye, but when they grow big, gee willikers, they're just the dickens to deal with. The third step is to dry your boat and everything that's in it, and that includes your hunting gear. Everything has got to be dry. After all, invasive species can survive in just small bits of water for days. Let your stuff dry for at least a week before traveling to another lake. But if you don't have a lot of drying out time, swing by the car wash to use high pressure soapy water. That'll do the trick in a pinch. And don't forget the trailer while you're at it. And there you have it. Clean, drain, and dry your boat, trailer, gear, and hunting equipment. A thumbs up to you too for being a responsible hunter and protector of our lakes. We don't want to spread invasive species. We get a lot of enjoyment from our lakes. Let's love those lakes back. That's all for now. Remember, keep Texas hunting everything it's <laughs> quacked up to be. <laughs> uh, it gets me every time.